Hey guys, welcome back to Isabel's Moments with Crafts. Um, I'm Isabel, and we're going to do an unboxing. So I know it's a little bit different setup. I'm in my room because my husband's still working, but it's been a while. I haven't um, recently started to get back into diamond painting, but I haven't diamond painted recently because... Um, myth and Magic and other challenge groups, I've been needing to stitch more. So my other crafts have kind of been put by the wayside, but I did get a diamond painting. And it is a diamond art club painting. And so information on this real quick. It is... This one is still available on, it. it's available, it's in stock and is available. When I purchased it um, for the pre-order on October 15th, um, it was just like the pre-order. Um, so like you could purchase it and then when they get, when they got stock in, they would send it to you. Um, you can see I got round I think at one point they had round and square, but I think right now it's only round. I don't know. I prefer square, but I saw this painting and I had to have it. Um, the reason I prefer square is my cat and other things. Um, is it, It's not likely to get stuck in the sticky area, but with having a cat, rounds is... It's very hard to keep the canvas clean when you have a cat and whatnot. But we're not here to hear about that. But I ordered it on October 15th. Um, it shipped on October 27th. So I want to say about two weeks. And then I received it um, November 1st. I did pay $49.99 for it. But I also had... A $15 coupon for it. Um, trying to think anything else. It did come in another box, but I didn't want to haul it out. You guys want to see what it is? I was so pumped. And so it is called A Savior is Born. And it's by Hannah Lynn. It's by Hannah Lynn. So Diamond Art Club license their artists so they pay their artists for their work and so that's why the diamond paintings are a little bit more and I don't mind supporting artists and paying for quality um paying for quality and um also the artist gets um paid as well and I, I saw this one. It was so pretty. And I'm just like, I had to have it. I went back and forth. But I'm like, I have to have it. Um, because I, I've noticed. Let me start unboxing it and I'll talk. Um, I've noticed um, some bit that uh, I do a lot of heaven and earth designs. And Hannah Lynn's one of my favorite artists. And there are some... Some um, charts that Heaven and Earth Design um, has, that Diamond Art Club has, and then there's also a couple um, paintings or whatnot that Diamond Art Club has, but Heaven and Earth Designs does not. And so there's a couple that. Um, I actually, I have as a, a, um, is a cross stitch pattern, but they also have it on the website for a diamond, like Ar Diamond Art Club has it as a kit. And so I thought maybe if I picked one of them and like compared like, Two different mediums of the same like design not design but the same art I mean it's I don't know you know what I mean 
like do the same one cross stitch, one diamond painting, and kind of compare um, one to the other. I know the cross stitch will have more colors in it because that's just how Heaven and Earth design roll. But I know these have quite a few. Yeah, about about half. Half the colors of what it would be. So. So forgive me. It's been a while since I've done an un unboxing. Probably like a year, year and a half. And usually I have my tripod. Um, and so I'm doing this a little differently because I'm one-handed <laughs> right now. So, I get that, and it says Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. So, we've got a couple things that they always bring in, and here's to Kitty. Um, they have a little sticker that you can put on, like, the box or what you're organizing it has the round um 20 by 28 centimeter inches by 51 centimeters and 71 centimeters so that's cool that's, that's pretty cool and then they have like an inventory like sticker sheet um with the all the information and the symbols which would be nice the kidding up because then I can just cut it out and stick it on there which saves me time writing it and then you have their toolkit ow I just stabbed myself um, I know a lot of you might have seen this, but for those of you who are new to diamond painting or new to diamond painting in general and you're coming across this and you're like, what does come in a diamond tool kit? So um, you get a blue pen, um, I think Diamond Art Club, it's a single tip, um, has their blue pen, unique. Um, you have a grip or a squishy and then two heart <clears throat> two pink whack hearts so this would be the equivalent of like a small square um, but Diamond Art Club are the only ones I think that do the heart which I love they're almost too cute to use my cat is trying trying desperately to eat the tools. I have not seen this one before. Like I said, I'm I'm out of the game. I haven't seen this one, so maybe it's just like a different design. Else book? I don't know. I think it works the same. But you go to multi tip. I think it's either maybe a four, three or four, and then you get this is what I'm working with over here <laughs> and then I get baggies as well and I think they come with enough baggies um, for um, every single color that it comes with I believe don't quote me <clears throat> yes it's gonna be shaky you know, I'll just deal with that later and hopefully my cat doesn't um, destroy it. So let's take a look at the canvas. Child. I'm going to just put this away for a second. I'm going to be at a weird angle, I know. I should have done this better, but oh well. Life is life. And then I'll probably keep that to put it back in 
because you know cats and this is like super velvety and then they pink pink the edge which is basically um they did something to it so uh um so it wouldn't fray it came this way and then step by step instructions if you've never done and painted before and the beautiful color oh those are upside down but all those beautiful colors and the sad thing is I have to wait to start this. Um, I do have a couple paintings on the go. Um, from, <gasps> look at her. Um, I do have a couple diamond paintings on the go. And the reason I say I can't start this gorgeous painting is I I don't remember who's doing it. it's Wolfpack Diamond Painting will be doing a is it a diamond painting or a collab of something like wintry and I totally thought that this one was wintry because it's the nativity and what do you think of the nativity? You think of Christmas, and Christmas happens in the winter time. So obviously, the symbols are clear, and you can even see like the extra sparkle on the painting. I am so excited to do this one. There's 49 colors. Kind of see. I know this video is probably going to be bad, and I'm sorry, but I wanted to show you guys what I got, so. And then you have the key symbol over here, and like the canvas itself is sparkly, so that's why, like this is sparkly too. So, and this is like giant, this is a uh, 20 by 28. But it's going to be gorgeous when it's done. So, pull back a little bit. Test the sticky. Oh yeah, that's definitely sticky. Like this lamb. Look how cute this lamb is. And then you have like this baby donkey and the baby bull. And the rooster and the three wise men and I liked how like this over here um, was like the eggs from the chicken I think people weren't sure but I'm pretty I want to say those are eggs to me they're eggs and then you got the Jesus's manger crib it's just it's gorgeous. I love it. <clears throat> um, let's see. Crinkle, crinkle, because I only got one hand. I don't want to take them out. They're so pretty. They're in there so nice. So nice and pretty. But there's two ABs. I'm sorry. The crinkle is real. I'm sorry. So yeah, you got these. All oh, these fun and they're just lighting off my favorite color my name is lots of black Hannah 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 Lynn is known for her black all this black like she's like I like her work because it's like kind of outlined and that's why there's a lot of black because everything is outlined 
We got black. We got some blues, some browns. There's her um, AB stands for Aurora Borealis, and it has a extra little like shine shine. Yeah, I know. I'm failing at this. I'm sorry, guys. We got some greens, grays, browns, pink, red, more. Kind of showing you what in there. And my cat's gonna come because Mama's playing with crinkles. Mama's playing with the crinkles. And she wants a part of the crinkles. So we got some more colors. Thought we had a, yep, we got a, a straggler. Some more blues, greens, a dark blue, some more green, blue, yellow, and more brown. He didn't notice there's a lot of brown too. Blue, yellow, blue, green, gray. Um, so you have your, your colors. Um, I think, I haven't looked at this. Uh, number one and number two are the sparkles. So you got them up here. The twos and the ones, and then you have it like outlined her. And you got some in her eyes. And baby Jesus. All throughout the lamb. A little bit in the chicken. And the donkey. There's none in the bowl. Yeah, the ones are kind of like in her her shawl or her, her dress. Oh my gosh, I just want to start this. I want to start this, but I can't. Yeah, see all the brown up here and all the way down here. And then you have this like huge section down, section down here. And her hair is brown. Oh, I'm so excited to work on it. Um, so if you liked, um, thanks for stopping by and seeing, um, what I received from Diamond Art Club. Um, I will, um, link the, the painting down below if you want to, want to get it. But I, I am super happy. I don't think I've ever been disappointed by Diamond Art Club before. I mean, probably back when I um, first started and I got like one of those those freebie ones where you just pay the shipping, and I that was back before I knew like if you got it smaller, like the detail was more pixelated, but they're still fun to do. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry it was all over and maybe and shaking. Hopefully I didn't make you sick. But I was excited about my new painting and I wanted to share it with you guys. Um, maybe I'll do some um, craft with me's where maybe I do some diamond painting one week, cross stitch another week, and maybe crochet another week. I don't know. Like that's the goal is I want to do like craft with me's where I do like every other like share the wealth of my different crafts but um we shall see i've yet to do that but the i was hopefully like doing like a floss tube every other week and then on the opposite week do the craft with me but that hasn't happened yet so we'll see but um thanks for joining me um uh let me know 
down in the comments if you have this one or you have a Christmas um, painting that you're planning on working on this year. Um, but until ne next time, um, <clears throat> stay positive and happy crafting. Bye!